to pardon the mess in here uh, I've been playing auction stuff uh, three bucks freebie those are both post drills this one is missing the advanced thing that hooks into here and spins the little dude from the bottom side little gear uh, and it's missing the handle so three bucks what the hell this one it all works except that there's no handle to turn the, the gear and then over here I just got this one like minutes ago. This was not an auction. This was a friend has this. It's like I, he's like offered it to me for ten bucks. It is complete, and it has the advance uh, on the top side of the gear, and it runs off of a cam down here. Sorry for the lighting. I, I don't have the lights on, but anyway, I also got a whole bunch of hand saws, and I've been refurbing them. So uh, I made a pecan handle for this one. That was all that was left of the handle on it. And then this one's got a, an apple handle. It is actually a, uh, the, yeah, the little deal here. Uh, it says warranted superior, and come to find out that's a distant uh, plate that was made for OEM. So for, it's for other manufacturers. And it says standard on the uh, blade there in, in the uh, etching. And then this was one of them that was in the batch. I got like 12 saws for 15 bucks. But this is a D8 Distin and Sons. And according to my research, the medallion on this one, let's see if it clears up. Come on. You're clear. Focus. Focus. It's not focusing. But anyway, uh, I looked at the uh, online for the medallion, and it dates back to the 1870s. I was like, that's really not in that bad of shape for a saw that's over 100 years old. Uh, of course, it's been oiled. I, I let them soak in vinegar and took all the rust off that I could. And then there's two more over here that I'm working on. And let's see here. There is this little plane that was a freebie that came with the freebie uh, post drill. So this is a wooden body plane. I'll be doing a video on that one. I'm also going to do a video on restoring the D8 and a video on restoring uh, that post drill, the one that's all there. I'm going to take it apart and clean it up, oil it, do whatever, and, and uh, paint it and make it pretty, and it's going to become a permanent fixture. Um, let's see, what else was there? Geez, there's so many exciting things here recently, it's kind of hard to keep up with. Um, anyway, all this is going on because I am turning, uh, the, the shop is going more and more towards hand tools, obviously, and you guys can blame, um, you guys can blame, um, what's it called, uh, uh, Wood by Wright. I kind of took a liking to his channel. I like what he does, so I'm kind of moving towards that a little bit. I'm still going to use power tools. Uh, I'm still going to use my bandsaw, uh, and I'm still going to do wood turning videos. I also want to build a uh, treadle lathe one of these days. I've been wanting to do that for years anyway, um, but I am moving sometime in the next month and a half uh, to a new shop, to a new property, about an hour and a half from where I currently am. And so there's going to be a whole lot of changes. I will hopefully have a more of a studio presence type of a shop. Um, but I'm moving to a farm in the middle of Kansas City, Missouri. Now, how these people that have hired me to come be the caretaker at their farm found a farm in Kansas City, Missouri, where the population is like half a million, I will never know. But what the heck, I've done a lot of work for them over the years. and. Uh, uh, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna do it. You know, they're giving me a little apartment to stay in and on the property, and I'll take care of the farm and, you know, be the caretaker. And I still get to have the YouTube channel in the shop that I will live directly above. That sounds like fun. But I have to build my apartment, so that sounds like fun. Uh, gonna build a chicken coop. Uh, going to be building a deck around the hot tub. Uh, we'll probably do at least portions of videos of all three of those. Um, and whatever else comes up. I mean, we're going to have to move the sawmill, so that means I'll probably do a video about moving that monstrosity, um, let alone the shop itself. Plus, I get to build out the shop the way that I want, so be looking forward to a lot of uh, videos on how I'm arranging the shop and, and how it's all going to function and why I'm arranging it that way. And I think it's going to be quite an adventure. 
So this is just a little vlog to let y'all know what's coming up. And, uh, you know, thanks for being subscribers. Thanks for watching. Uh, I'm really, uh, I'm a little bit overwhelmed right now with all this stuff going on. I have like a list of things I write down as, as I come across ideas that I want to do videos for. And that list is really long. And I think some of it will be very interesting. Of course, I've got all these new hand saws. I've got to build a saw tail. Uh, you know, I've got a post drill now. I've got to do the refurb video for that. I have the, the plane video. Uh, I have a video coming up that is of a tool cabinet that I built. Well, not a tool cabinet, excuse me. It's a, um, what, what the heck was it called? Jointer's toolbox. Uh, I built one of those. I haven't done the, the inserts for it with all the tools in it yet because I don't know exactly what tools are going to go in. However, I'm going to go ahead and post the video building it with the bare naked inside, uh, and we'll put tools in it later on. Uh, and I'll, I'll do a video about the build out of that part. So I got a great idea. Lots of, well, I think they're great. But anyway, <laughs> I got lots of ideas for uh, videos that I think will be interesting to everybody. Uh, however, the move kind of throws a monkey wrench into it. So there's going to be a little bit of a, a flub uh, in there. And then, <laughs> and then we'll get back to some really serious uh uh, woodworking and we're going to be doing a lot of refurb uh, videos obviously uh, because I'm probably going to continue collecting up uh, these tools like this. I, I'm enjoying the, the the refurbishing of them as much as I do enjoy using them so you know whatever. Uh, but anyway I just wanted to post this little quickie to let you all know what's going on okay. Uh, I will still be around. I will still be doing videos. Uh, they may get a little uh, here and there type instead of trying to post weekly I might get miss a week now and then because of what's going on uh, but this whole move is probably going to take me into July uh, before it's all said and done um, but it won't start it doesn't start for another uh, four to six weeks so we're, we're waiting uh, for a 100% uh, move-in date yet so anyway exciting 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 so uh, thank you all again and I hope we'll see you at the next one the, the block plane or excuse me the wooden plane video should be up uh later on in the week uh thursday wednesday thursday area i think so anyway thanks for watching we'll see you next time